Hello everyone and welcome back to another video. This one is going to be a little different because we're not putting in an animal in this one. Uh, we're not building a habitat. Instead we're going to, you know, I had this area of, you know, just grass that was kind of like, you know, in between. It's going to kind of be in between um, the temperate part and I think the African part. I haven't really decided what's going next. But you know, it's one of these like kind of in between areas. I didn't really know what to do with it. I felt like I would just be cramming animals in if I put an animal there. So I decided to make it, you know, a little place for the guests. So it's going to be kind of like a park. It's going to have um, a playground, a little lake where you can go out on a little on a pier. It's like a few planks of wood over the water. I don't know what to, what to call it. Uh, you know, you can relax, let your kids play. I'm going to have two of these new... Um, like food counters, I guess they're called. Uh, one for some, you know, sweets and one for like slushes and ice cream. So, you know, places to sit. And I know, I know we all want the guests to be able to interact with these kind of things, you know, playgrounds and things, but they can't. I tried to make it so that the guests can at least walk in most of the parks. So maybe it will look like they're interacting with it. Uh, obviously they will be able to interact with the food and the benches and things. But yeah, I tried to make it so that the guests will actually like walk in the park and it will look like they're using it. Uh, the playground was actually really fun to make. Uh, I really had to use my creativity there to make, you know, make it work. And I am building a play structure, like a climbing with slides and everything. However, it turns out I did not record that. I usually don't forget to record things, but I guess I got so caught up in it. I, I, it there was no recordings of me building this, but I promise I built it. <laughs> and I will upload it to the workshop in case anyone wants to use it in their own zoo and like look closer at it. You know, it, it looks kind of like square and bulk because that's the building pieces I had. I'm not yet super good with, you know, using a piece that's meant for something else and turning it into something completely different like some people out there. But I, I think it looks okay. Like in the end, it looks like a play structure. It just it could probably look better. But yeah, I'm very happy with that. I made some like other little play things, like a little obstacle course and swing set and things. And you know, you're gonna see me put down some like blackish uh, flooring under the playground, and that's supposed to be. I don't know if you know, but some playgrounds have these like almost rubbery uh, flooring under it. Uh, that kind of soft. But it's not sand, uh, so it's more like rubber, I guess. I don't know. It's probably something complete. Like, it's probably not rubber, but it feels like rubber. And that's what that's supposed to be. It's not supposed to be like asphalt or uh, concrete or anything, in case you're wondering. But yeah, I will put the play structure and the little, you know, shop shelves that I made for these counter shops uh, in the workshop and link them down below in case you want to use them. But yeah, I'm actually really happy with how this turned out and it's and I really like that the bison habitat that we made in the last episode is a little bit elevated because if you like go down to the guest level in the park, you know, you know, angle the cameras or at the level where the guests would be, you kind of see the buffaloes and things because they're, you know, up there, you know, above you a little so you can see them from the park and I think it just turned out pretty good. Uh, I think we only have like one or two more habitats to make in the temperate part, part. And then we'll be moving on. I don't know what to next. I think Africa, but it's not cited at all. Um, so stay tuned. I hope you enjoy this video and thank you so much for watching.
Thank <laughs> you.